guys! Today I'm gonna show you where did I buy items from Asian market. A few items I wanna recommend to you are Japanese item or another country, I mean Asian country, food. So I hope you can enjoy. Check it out. Yesterday, I went to Asian supermarket. Uh, there is a lot of items, so many kind of, uh, you know. So I think you will confuse which is good, which is uh, good taste or more interesting. So I hope I can help you when you buy item, uh, Asian, Asian food item from Asian market. Yesterday, I bought this items. This is 30 items. Okay, let me explain about each item. Maybe first, yes, this is popular. Soy sauce, right? Most people know that. Soy sauce, show you, this is show you. This is very important for for making Japanese food. Yeah, I love soy sauce so much. So actually, when you go to Asian supermarket, you have a lot of choice for soy sauce. But um, I think any shoyu is any soy sauce is good taste product from Japan, Japan company. You have a lot of choice for soy sauce, of course, but a lot of prices. Each one different price. So this one was this one was four nine nine, almost five dollar. This is a pretty good price. So sometimes another brand soy sauce, uh, something like a eight dollar or nine dollar. So this is five dollar, pretty good price. Oh, next, I bought this one. It's from Kikoman. Kikoman, man. Hey, this is Mammy. Uh, noodle soup base, right? So, yes, you can use this one for soba, uh, udon, and then like a smoothie soma, and like a donburi or tempura. Yes, this Mammy is. First time for me because in Japan you can buy from Hokkaido like a very specific location you can buy this meme and this meme is so good to taste really really before uh, I bought like a, a noodle soup base for udon or soba whatever I bought this uh, Honsuyu this is from Kikoman too. Okay, right? You can see it like that. Can you see that? I love this uh, product. But yesterday I couldn't find this one, so, and then instead uh, I found this one, so, oh, maybe I can try this one, so, yeah. It must be good taste, really good taste. This one was oh, 529. It means like a, yeah, almost five dollar, six dollar. Yeah, pretty good price. So this is frozen, frozen udon, right? So you have many choices for udon, uh, dry udon, and then like a. Uh, Looks like it's just packed and soft and I would recommend the frozen udon. If you don't like chewy, chewy udon, you don't have to eat this frozen udon. Most of Japanese people love like chewy udon, okay? Uh, how do I say? Koshigaru, koshigaru. Mm, this is good. Yeah. This is also product of Japan, but any frozen wooden tastes like uh, almost the same so you can you can buy anything any any frozen wooden so oh, this one was 409 49 
almost like four dollar yeah pretty good price so another choice was like uh, five dollar six dollar yeah this is good. This is a good price, yeah. So by um, okay. Oh, I'm not sure. Actually, I'm not sure which soba is good taste, like a like a brand. A lot of time I bought I bought this brand. So this is three seventy nine, almost four dollar. Yeah, pretty good price too. Right, and the good point. Uh, good point is you can cross like a zipper. Yeah, I love this style. So and next, so another noodle. A lot of noodle I want to buy every time. <laughs> so next is salmon. Okay, right? Salmon is popular in Japan, of course. Like uh, especially like summertime. Summertime. You can say summer equal salmon. <laughs> uh, here you can check how to cook salmon and not difficult. It's not difficult, super easy. So like you know, almost same like udon or soba. Yeah, just boil. Next, oh, wait. this is natto, frozen natto, right? Actually, my husband don't like natto, but I love natto, so sorry, my husband. <laughs> and it was, uh, this was price, uh, price is $2.29, almost like a two, like mozzarella, like that, yeah, and three packs. This is first time for me, so just I want to try it. I'm not sure what taste, if this is good or not, so. And then next, alright, alright, this one. This is marble dof sauce. I mean, sauce for mapo tof, mapo tof. So you can cook uh, uh, beef and uh, and beef and tofu. This is a little spicy but good taste. And this one was uh, one dollar. This is ch uh, this is Chinese food, but uh, very uh, marble top is popular in Japan. Yeah, very much. And next, okay, this is Koshian Uncle Yay, sweeted red. <laughs> this one you can eat with mochi, mochi. Anko mochi you can make easier, like you can make easier anko mochi. Price was two dollar. Okay, if you want to buy this from Amazon, so expensive. Each one like six dollar or seven dollar. I'm glad I find it just for two dollars. Each one two dollars, okay? Wow, I can wait to eat koshian with. This one is ume pickled plum, salted plum, umeboshi, pickled plum. This brand, uh, shirakiku again. That's nice. I think it must be good taste. Price was five thirty nine. Mm. Yeah, another product also like that. Price so. yeah. And the next, so this one is taku or like a pickled radish. And actually, this is from Korean. I think Korean brand. But taste was like a Japanese Japanese pickled radish, like almost the same. So it was pretty good. So I can recommend you this pickled radish too. So this price was $2.59. So another product, another product of pickled radish was more four dollar, five dollar. So it this one was not good. Yeah, you can try it. So this one is a egg plum, right? And I 
I could I will cook for tempura or like a marble. Yeah. This was good match actually this marble sauce. Good match. Price was oh 50 56 cents. This one. Yakinori roasted seaweed. Seaweed. For uh, I I use this one for sushi. The price was $2.29 Yeah, pretty good price So total, total price uh, was $38.4 Like awesome, almost $38 I think I think pretty good price So did you enjoy? If you liked it, please thumbs up and leave your comment down below. Thank you so much for watching my video. See you again later. Bye.